Apoy Gaming here. We are going to watch another S4 Champion Cup Tournaments match. Who will be banned first? Definitely is Ninja. No Ninja in Basketball Court. Haha. <laughs> and our next Ninja Sasuke get banned too. He can laugh at them. This match Ninja have no ball ball to play. First pick will be Short Hair Sakuragi. No doubt to snatch the best rebounder first. If they are not banning Takasago, mean giving them a chance to pick Kainan Duo, Miyawasu and Takasago. Then the blue team will have the hard time to face pick and roll. The best is to pick one Shosaki or Ryoji to counter the Kainan duo. Uh, the red team pick Oda, mean they have two rebounders for them. Who will the last one to pick? And the red team pick one Kenji Fujima in order to set up their offense. The blue team pick Nobunaga Kiyota to pose more threats to their rim. This must be very interesting match. Let's start, let's start. Should be no surprise that Sakuragi will win the jumbo. After Sakuragi won the jumbo and Kenji has found a wide open. And Monkey shouted it out loud, not in my house. The blue team has a very good formation. Miyawasu is playing the point guard role. And Monkey is to score and attract two defenders on him. And Monkey did a leap down in no time after receiving the pass from Miyawasu. While Oda and Sakuragi miss position. Nice one. Kenji is very hard to score if Miyawasu just in front of him. Oda suddenly stepped in and found a wide open. But no luck. Nagasako grabbed the rebound and passed to Miyawasu. And Miyawasu did a quick step back and reset the possession. And immediately did a pump fake then passed to Monkey. And Monkey scored by a second points layout. And it's good. Kenji answered back by a quick side step shot. Now Monkey is gaining all the spotlight on him. I am so jealous. Wow, this is new. Guys, take note, take note. Leap away from the pen and did a normal jump shot. And it's good. I never thought of this kind of move. From now on, this can be added to our arsenal. Ah, ah, ah. Oda wasted no time and quickly scored 2 points by his step back fade away. But it is a very good deal from Monkey. The blue team clearly has the advantage. Takasako will scream for Miyawasu. Mean two defenders need to assist in defense, but also need two defenders to defense monkeys fast and slow down, or two points lay out, or dunks or step back. And Miyawasu did the same strategy again, passing the ball to the monkey for a leg down while he attracted two defenders. This is a best shot selection from Oda. He directly pulled out and shoot around the paint area while there is two defenders just around him. And good block from Takasago. Another one, this time Monkey did a second points layup since only one defender in the paint and he won the bat. Miyawasu did a good job to stop Genji crossover. The red team has come down and slowly finding a good opportunity. Sakuragi and Oda try to create space and finally Genji found a wide open tree. It's no good. Sakuragi nearly find a wide open. But Monkey leaped forward to him and he chose to pass to Oda. And Oda did a good fade away with a light interference. Sakuragi grabbed another offensive rebound and Oda tried again. But this time Monkey leaped forward and blocked the shot. Takasako did a nice screen and the screen pushed Kenji away. Miyawasu used his Audi for a good tree. <laughs> OMG OMG the possession is so intense. Now the red team is feeling the pressure. He did a layout while two defenders are just in front of him. No doubt, it's a bad choice. The blue team is started to slow down the pace and no one is able to stop Monkey's LD. This is 11 points gaps. To be honest, he still got chance to turn the tables. Kenji did a bad shot when Miyamasu just in front of him. Takasago secured the rebound with his LD. From this match, we can understand two facts. A good formation is important. A good defensive practice that can assist in defense maybe is the key of this match. This is the despicable skill from Takasago. When the passer does a long pass, it will easily pass to Takasago when he hands up. It is a very funny moment, but do not keep doing this while you are defending the tanks because when you stop asking the ball, it has a slight delay and we will miss the blocking timing. From the blue team formation, Miyawasu is the point guard. He will set out the offense and shooting three if got wide open chance. Takasago be the support role, doing screen and grabbing rebounds. And Monkey is the main scorer. So we can see, Kenji is very hard to defend Miyawasu. The bully just keep pushing him away. Yeah, yeah, their vision is so clear. I think the red team mind is stuck, making bad choices in PP session. And also a lot of bad shot selection. Miyawasu and Monkey in this match have shown us how good their observations are. Miyawasu created the opportunities for Monkey, and Monkey pulls the final trigger by choosing which move he is going to use. In defensive side, Monkey reserves his leap forward skill, 
for the shot he can block or at least can interfere the shot now the point difference is huge if they are able to slow it down rather than take the risky shot they may still have the tiny chance to close the gap so Apoi what we can learn from this match ah finally my turn first the monkey show us how good the character can be the lip tongue timing is perfect Zero mistakes when Mian Wasu created the opportunities for him. He can do layups, leg dunks, leap backward and do a normal jump shot. And he didn't misjudge for any moments. Second, the formation is bad for the red team. They didn't do any counter pick. Excellent pick and roll for the Kainan duo. And remaining the threats in the paint area. With two rebounders, the red team is losing in rebounds. Which is no good, no good. The point is... Or that did few mistakes in the early game that caused the red team lose their mind and becoming more rushing to score which resulted one-sided outcome. For a one Kenji, in order to maintain his ulti for the whole match, he need to use one more time of his ulti during his ulti time. If you are unable to perform just like this match, even you have the chance to use the double ulti, it just can't save the team. And I think Coach Anza is cursing the red team. Few shots are damn good. But ended with a miss. Haha, <laughs> that is their luck. This is a great showcase for Monkey, Takasago, and Miyamasu. Still can be very great against a Vamps player. Do you have any additional advice, Boy Gaming? Yeah, yeah, yeah. After you watch this Monkey King performance and your hand feel itchy to play as him, please click the link on top and you will be the next Monkey King. Damn, letting you have the chance to promote your video again. Don't be like this, we are buddy buddy. So what should we do now? If we are aiming to the top, we have to train our defense concept and not just rely on character skill. If you like the content, please hit the like button and subscribe my channel. Thank you guys, I will be back.